I, I, I've, I've never killed anyone. I'm not leaving you behind. You start butchering their people, and our chances of making it out of here, any of us, go down to zero. They had some supplies just sitting out, and Norma caught me. I didn't think she was going to, but she, she, she let me go. Hope you're not thinking about jumping. Because if you do, I'm gonna have to come in after you. I'm not looking forward to that. Water's gonna be an ice bath. Really? You come after me? You're one of us now. And I can't be the only brains around here. Oh, freezing my ass off. Yeah. Coffee will warm you up. Go on. <coughs> God damn, Oak. You can't call it coffee when more than half's whiskey. Uh, you sound like my ex-wife. She was more of a rum girl. Despised a lot of them when I first got on board, but they grow on you. Like mole, they are. Nah, nah, sorry, that shit is now. They're growing on me too. Kind of nice that people can still joke around. It's a fine line between the court jester and the village idiot. You can guess which side I think he's on. Before I joined up with Pete, my brother and I were cooped up in an old canning factory. Food for ages. A lot of fat and happy people. But then, a young girl got taken. We followed a trail. It wasn't hard with all the blood. Ended up cornering the people who took her in this warehouse. All ten of us went in. Only I came out. You did the right thing. And it got my brother killed. The right thing can kiss my ass. A few weeks later, I came across Pete, a ways up the coast. He saw that look on my face and he offered me a job. Didn't ask any questions, didn't turn me away, just welcomed me in. Pete's a good goddamn egg in a rotten world. 
I don't always get Pete, but I'm glad people like him still exist. I'll drink to that. Well, I think Berto's little routine is winding down so we can finally play cards. Care to join us? It'd be nice to have you there. Besides, none of us can remember the rules. So, it'd be the most, uh, unique game of Go Fish you've ever played. Yeah. Do me in. Sounds like a challenge. You might regret it when I win that machete of yours. Hey there, Michonne. Sam, I knew you couldn't stay away. Don't fucking talk to me. <laughs> Sam, stop! Easy, all right? Jesus! Little help here! Please, I need a hand! What the? Let go of me! to help. We can't have this guy more damaged than he already is. Sam clearly needed it. Feel better? Not until he's dead. When I get out of here, I'll do a lot more than break a few of your ribs. Ugh. Fuck. <laughs> What's funny here is you think me and my sister are the bad ones. But you're the one who burned down our home. Forced our people on the shore to be easy pickings for the walkers. Families, kids, never did shit to you. Didn't stop to think about all the lives you were screwing up. All the shit they had to leave behind. Ignore him, Michonne. Probably burned beyond recognition now. <laughs> Michonne! I'm not, uh, upsetting you, am I? You're done talking. You're the one who should be dead. Sam, calm down. My dad isn't even in the fucking ground yet, and you want me to calm down? I, I didn't mean he ruined everything. He killed... I know, I know. Pick you don't know. Michelle. Wait. You hear that? Answer me. Now. Michonne? You don't want to keep me waiting. You trying to piss her off? Calm the fuck down. You should change your fucking tone. You might be sitting pretty thinking you have the upper hand. But your luck has changed. Michonne and Sadiq. They got the rest of the crew, too. Oak and Berto. Look, whatever this bitch asks, don't... Sadiq! Don't worry. They're all in good hands here. But them staying that way is up to you. So listen closely. I'm willing to trade my brother for your friends. But anything you do to Randall, I will do to them. Do you understand? And I hope you weren't lying about him being okay. Look, you don't owe me anything, but please... We have to get them back. That's my deal, Michonne. I understand. That's what I like to hear. We'll be there by sunrise. Be ready for us. Shit. <laughs> so, 
what do you think's going to happen next? <laughs> <laughs> what? There's something on my face. The bruises aren't so bad. Right? I'm pretty sure she'll notice the fingers. Shut up! Maybe it won't matter. This has to work. It could be worse, you know? At least he's not dead. We'll get our friends back. Alive. That's if Norma keeps her word. The minute you hand him over, she's gonna take that bag off his head. What then? <laughs> you all have no idea what you're in for. Ugh. He's right. Norma's not gonna leave us alone. She won't stop just because we gave her her brother back. Sure, you kept him alive, but we still burned all their shit. So we run. After you trade for your friends, we haul ass to the back gate and get the hell out of here. But she'd take the house. Let her have it. Wouldn't she expect us to run? So what? She knows where we are now. Hiding isn't an option. Where do you propose we go? I don't know. Does it matter? Anywhere would be better than here. I can't fucking listen to this. What? Sam, where are you going? I'll watch him. Sam! Stop. You're going to hurt yourself. God damn it. Sam, stop. Maybe you're all ready to walk away, but I'm not just going to leave him like this. We couldn't get my mom a real funeral. My dad and I... I had to bury her here. Just the two of us. He'd want to be with her. That's all I can give him. I understand. He should be buried with your mom. But we can't focus on that right now. We have to be ready to leave. I'm not going. What? 
Uh, Sam, you can't still be thinking My that... mom is here, Paige. Everything I have of her. And Greg, if you want to leave, go ahead, but I'm not coming with you. I'm sorry, but I, I can't go. This house meant everything to my dad. It's all I have left. I won't force you to leave. If you want to stay, that's up to you. You don't have to leave either. We can defend this house. We can fight them off. No matter what happens, thank you. I owe you my life. Sorry it took me so long to say it. I know it's stupid, but I have to finish this. I've got some weapons stashed in my room. Old duffel bag. Should look familiar. You should make sure everyone's armed before Norma gets here. I, I was just wanted to know what it felt like. I, I wasn't gonna shoot it. Just. And? How does it feel? It's it's heavy. Empty. Can I help? I want to do something. Sure, go ahead. Those slide in there. Round side forward. How could they just die like that? Greg and Dad. I, I thought we were safe here. What am I supposed to do? Just keep your head down. Stay safe. I'm not afraid. I didn't say you were. Sometimes the brave thing is not to fight. <sighs> the guy who did it killed my dad. He's gotta... I mean... The things he said... The way he was laughing about Dad. You want to hurt him, don't you? Careful. Feelings like that can get you in trouble. I heard you guys talking. There's more people coming. To the house. Sam's hurt. If... If she... They can't hurt her too. You have to stop them. Sam needs you right now. Go. Help her. Here. I, I don't know if I'm ready. You know, to have one. Don't forget what I told you. If things go bad, keep out of sight. Norma's on her way. Things could go wrong in a hurry. She didn't always come to this. Janie, Rich, what's hold up? Prisoners aren't cooperating. What do you want to do? Yeah, we don't have time for this. Get them moving.
Is that... music? I can't reach you. Can I come in? I like that. It's pretty. My dad gave it to me, so I wouldn't have to hear the things out there. As long as I stay in my fortress, I'm safe. It keeps all the bad stuff out. I put pillows and blankets against the wall. Was this your dad's idea? Yeah. My dad makes sure I'm always safe, so nothing can happen to me. Ever. Especially not those... things. I know what those monsters out there are. One to go. Grandma told me about them. It's what happens when someone... eats another person. Oh? I hadn't heard that one before. Do they scare you too? They make lots of noise. Even at night. Getting scared is normal. Really? Happens to everyone sometimes. But my dad's not scared of them. I've been waiting for him. Where is he? Why didn't he come get me yet? Where is my dad? Your dad's not coming. He's dead. What? He got shot outside. No! I don't believe you! I want to see him. Please. <laughs> Did my dad be become one of them? It it it's what happens, right? He did, didn't he? No, your dad didn't become one of them. He's still your dad. It's not fair. Alex, you need to be strong, okay? I can't. Two and three checked in. Coming up on the road now. Hey, keep the chatter to a minimum. Our friends are listening. <laughs> Oh, hey, I, I didn't hear you come in. Here. Here, Pete. Thanks. Oh, Mary, don't you weep. 
boo are the people who look so grand. They must be headed for the promised land, for Pharaoh's army got drowned. And oh, Mary, don't you weep. They are so happy, just hear them sing. They must be looking for the coming king, for Pharaoh's army got drowned. And oh, Mary, don't you weep. Oh, Mary, don't you weep, don't you weep. Oh, Mary, don't you weep. Don't I'm a guest in this house. Where are your manners? You found the bag? Yeah, here. Thanks. Are the others ready? As ready as we're gonna get. I'm looking for Alex. Have you seen him? I want him to be there when I say a few words for Dad. He wasn't at Mom's funeral. He should be there for this. He's hiding in his closet. Thanks. I'll go get him. I'll meet you outside. Sam, you okay? Greg and Dad, I just, I don't really know what to say. Where am I supposed to start? I don't know. Just say what he meant to you. Yeah. Okay. I'll give you a moment. Hey, you okay? Michonne. Just thinking about my kids. I keep seeing them. Hang in there. We'll be back out on the water soon. You know, I envy them a little. They've managed to hold on to something we all lost a long time ago. Looking like normal. I don't know how to describe it. It feels like before. Just a little bit. Sound like an idiot, don't I? Your boat comes close to that. You kind of forget everything else while you're out there. Hey, it's gonna be tough leaving this place. I just wish Sam would go too. Michelle? She's here! I thought we had more time. It's okay, it's gonna be okay. Sam! Just go upstairs with your brother, okay? I need you to hide until I come get you. What's gonna happen? You gonna hurt us? You'll stop them, right? Right? Whatever happens, I'll protect you. Everything will be fine. Stay together, no matter what. We will. Okay.
I can get a clear shot of the front gate from upstairs. I'll cover you. If I can. I hope it doesn't come to that. You better not miss. I hope I don't. Paige, if anything goes wrong, I need you to take care of James and Alex. Don't talk like that. Paige, please. Sam, you know I'll... Grab Randall and meet us outside. It's quiet out there. You ready for this? Anything goes wrong out there, I got your back. Right. Just stay alert and be ready for anything. We don't know what Norma's planning. You got it. It's just me. What the hell is going on here? I had my people hang back a bit. I wanted to talk first. Just us. Clear the air a little. What's your game? No game. I just want to talk. I'm not really interested in hearing what you have to say. I just want my people back. And you'll get them. Just give me a chance. Listen. Monroe is gone. Sunk down in the water like everything I built. You and I, we've each taken from the other. All I want now is my brother back. That's all. And I'll leave you be. You buying any of this? You'll get Randall after you hand over my friends. After everything you've done, you expect me to simply hand over your friends. Just like that. Careful, Michonne. A show of good faith, then. Any minute now. Safe and sound, just like I said. Now, I want to see my brother. Who cares about Randall? These people murdered Zachary. We're all homeless because of her. Kill them and be done That with is them. not what we are here for. Now be quiet. My brother, now. I have given you what you wanted. I just want to see him. He's right here. Randall, you okay? Just hang on. I got you. See? We can work together. Release that one. This is bullshit! Glad you're safe, man. I made good on my end. Now it's your turn. Nah. Give me Randall. Huh. Oh! Hey, put the gun down. I could shoot him and still have one more to spare. So you're gonna do what I've asked. Now! I came here willing to talk. But if you're gonna insist on being difficult... Don't hurt him, all right? <clears throat> Here. Take him. Who gives a shit about Randall? Jonas, don't! If you're not gonna punish them for what they've done, I will. We deserve retribution. Not like this. This is for Zachary. No! <clears throat> Berto! Everyone put your guns <clears throat> down. I knew we couldn't trust them. Don't! 
stand down! Please, don't hurt him. If you're not gonna do anything, we have to. That's not your call. Please. They shot her! Jonas! Fuck!
you want me to do. I can't go back. I can't save you. I can't fix this. I wish I had. There's nothing I can do. Michelle, it's Dominic. What's Where the hell are you? Go back your things, okay? We have to go. Where's mommy? We tried to wait. We're, we're, we're heading to Donna. Dad! She'll be fine. Come on. No, she'll come look for us. We have to be here. Michonne, if you're still... Just stay safe, okay? They need you. Did you... Did you get out? Did you make it? I need to know. See you again. When? I don't know. Soon. Say goodbye, girls. Your mother has to leave. Leave, Mama? Stay here. With us. She can't. Just let her go. Dominic, please. Give us a minute. Come on, Alex! What are you doing? <coughs> no. Girls, enough. Let her leave if that's what she wants. Michelle! No, no, no. Don't go. Colette. She can't stay. We can't stay here! It's too late. Your mother already made up her mind. I wish you could come with me. Michelle!
Sadiq's gonna take a boat down to what's left of Monroe. Salvage what we can. We can drop you off in Oceanside or maybe one of the other communities up north. It's good people. Thanks. And thank you for everything. I don't know if we would have made it out of there without you. You found my brothers. You took care of Norma. You're welcome. It'll be harder out there, without Berto. Might lean on you a bit more. It's not gonna be the same without him. Yeah, I'm gonna miss him too. I know this has been harder, in more ways than one. When we got separated, I heard you calling for your daughters. What happened in there? I tried to find you, but I couldn't. I had to get everyone out and... I saw my daughters. I got to talk to them. That, that's not possible, right? For them to be there. I know. Maybe you'd better start thinking about, you know, what if this doesn't go away? Maybe it won't. But this time, when I saw them, I was able to walk away. I couldn't keep living in that moment with them anymore. I think it's time to stop running. Go back to your group, the people you left, your family, before you can't anymore. If I know anything, it's how goddamn impermanent things are these days. You trying to get rid of me? Ah, uh, you caught me. Come on. Deeper down like the roof. 